There are moments where ancient wisdom crosses paths with groundbreaking artistic and cultural movements. Has such a time finally come again? The Renaissance, a period of intellectual and cultural awakening, echoes with the resonance of classical learning from Greece and Rome. Artists drew inspiration from ancient myths, history, and philosophy, sparking a curiosity for Eastern ideas during the Age of Exploration. In Western art and academia, the infusion of Eastern influences led to the rise of the concept of exoticism. For example, Orientalism, termed by Edward Said in 1978, describes Western interest in the East as reinforcing stereotypes and serving colonial agendas. While relatively true in secular realms, exoticism or Orientalism doesn't apply to spirituality, a universal human longing that transcends politics. Pioneers from the West, who saw the universalism of the Vedas, and their existential power beyond borders brought Vedic wisdom to the Western world. Scholars like Sir William Jones, Abraham Hyacinth Anquetil Duperon, and Max Miller paved the way for a deeper understanding of the ancient texts, transcending cultural boundaries, but also gave poets, artists, and the world access to treasures of spirituality that are life-changing. The fusion of Eastern wisdom with Western creativity flourished through movements like symbolism, Poets like Baudelaire or Keats incorporated mystical themes from Vedic and Buddhist literature, creating a meaningful poetry of unprecedented beauty. Although some exoticism and Orientalism persist in insidious forms within ourselves and find expressions within our mundane lives, academia, and art, it's time to break free from these constraints and embrace the depth of wisdom embedded in these ancient texts. As we face global challenges akin to the Dark Ages, parallels emerge with our current struggles. From the collapse of the Roman Empire to today's societal schisms, the echoes of history beckon us to seek wisdom beyond mundane politics. In this pursuit of wisdom, poets play a crucial role and need to facilitate the Vedic Renaissance, rejecting ignorance and embracing a universal understanding of non-duality in poetry and art. As we navigate the complexities of our world, May the fusion of ancient wisdom and modern creativity illuminate new horizons for poets and artists alike.